You taking a save break? Be careful you don't overwrite the wrong file. It's kind of cute in here. Not as cute as me. Does it really have to be a competition? Yes! Come on, don't be like that. Do you really want to run into Saki with a sour look like that on your face? I don't care what I look like as long as I get to see her. Yeah, me too. So come on, Pinkoon. Let's go rescue her together. Of course! And when we do find her, I've got a mountain of questions to ask. And I don't want to fight. So there are only three enemies. No problem, I'll right? Away. Ugh, hot, you like not to be around. Hot, 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 hot. Yeah, you like hot. You like hot, not so fast. You so good. You like hot. Hot, 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 hot.
what are we gonna do? Uh, an enemy! Yeah! <sighs> this isn't easy. By myself. You don't have to push yourself. Take a little break. Well, this is rare. Aren't you always telling me how we neats need to work harder and stop slacking off all the time? I, I'm not a demon or anything. When you're at your limit, you're at your limit. Even you, dingus. All right. I'll take you up on your offer then and rest for a spell. You want something cool to drink? <laughs> I'm fine, but thanks. But you know what? Something's really starting to dawn on me now. What is it? The only reason I've been able to come this far is because of all the people standing by my side. I take it Neats don't usually have anyone standing by their side? No, that's not it. I had my fair share of friends in middle school, high school, and even college. So you're a fraudulent Neat. You're a part of the real world after all. I wasn't a Neat at all back then. Though, there was really only ever one other person who was always by my side. Was that... Mizuki? Yeah. The two of us were inseparable. But you can't work together anymore? Well... We were never going to be able to keep up with each other the way we were. And you know it. So consider this my goodbye. I honestly don't know. Asahi! Someone's coming this way! Could it be the DAB? We have to get out of here! Yeah, time to run! Wait! The exit's the other way! That's fine. I can do this. I won't keep letting other people beat me. I smell treasure. Find it, find it, find it! I 
could use a breather. Asahi! Look over there! Saki! Hey, Saki, are you okay? Wake up! Come on! Open your eyes! Shh! Quiet, please. Yeah. That girl has drifted off to Dreamland. A happy dream world, all her own. Canon? I can help you, though. I can show you to a wonderful delusion, sweeter than any dream you've ever had. What do you say? Are you interested? Interested in the ultimate delusion? The ultimate pleasure? Sweeter than any dream, remember? I guarantee it. You like delusions, don't you? Everybody does. They love them. Especially delusions we can get invested in. The ones that take us prisoner and blind us to all beyond ourselves. The ones where one person becomes happy and another un. You know the ones. And I can guide you straight to them. Yeah! Asahi! Damn it. I knew it'd be a bad idea to try to deal with this all alone. You're not alone. Mizuki? Don't get used to this, though. I'm only here to rescue my fellow freedom fighters. You know, at this point, I'll take what I can get. Oh, are you two acquainted? I suppose I'll have to add another name to the tour book. Any chance we can get a discount on a two-for-one ticket? Oh, there's a shrewd boy. But no, delusions are one player only, I'm sorry to say. A world just for you. That's what makes a delusion a delusion. So no discounts. Full price, individual sale. Then I think we'll let you keep the ticket yourself. What a generous offer. If I could, I would surely partake. We insist. If you won't end this, then we will. Oh, by all means, go right ahead. If you think you can, anyway. Stay on guard, Asahi. You too, Mizuki. Let the tour begin. Though, as I said, no discounts. So sorry. Is he still standing? I wouldn't let your guard down yet. Look at this. 
It seems neither of you were in need of guidance to a beautiful delusion sweeter than a dream, after all. Definitely not from you. Even so, we will meet again. He's gone. <laughs> Let him get away, did you? Boss! <sighs> just in the nick of time. Looks like our pal Saki here is just waking up. Saki! Pinkoon? Saki, are you alright? Asahi? How are you? Can you walk? And you, Mizuki? Oh, yes, I'm fine. Thanks. I can walk. Good. Sorry to make you hustle as soon as you wake up. We gotta be elsewhere five minutes ago. Understood. Alright, move out. Saki! You aren't hurt, are you? No, not at all. I missed you so much, Saki. Pinkoon. Just answer me one thing. Why did you... I'm sorry, but I really have to go. Wait! Hate to rain on your reunion parade, but Saki ain't right right now. How about you save the Inquisition for later? <sighs> there are some things that I need to know for sure. So Asahi, Pinkoon, this is goodbye. <laughs> She's gone. What could be that important? Huh? What are you all doing here? You're late, Chuckles. We've been waiting for you forever. We managed to rescue Akari, and she's safe and sound. It seems like the other girl's okay now, too. Wow. And your plan after that was just to wait here for me? Oh, pretty much. The Freedom Fighters passed us by just before you showed up. It was pretty tough to hold Ko back from destroying them. <laughs> Traitorous wench didn't even look my way. I keep telling you she's got to have her reasons. Yeah. Those reasons being she's part of the Freedom Fighters now. I thought you ran away. I had to come back to express my thanks. Asahi, you saved us. I'm nothing but grateful for that. <laughs> but don't get me wrong. This is just a show of... Hey, Mizuki! Don't you dare push Asahi by the wayside again. Uh, what? He's your oldest friend. How can you speak to him that way? Huh? You... Let me apologize for him, Asahi. Mizuki has some real honesty problems, and they always make things worse and worse. Huh? But, huh? Wait, does this mean that... Yeah, you're... Uh... Maybe... Seriously, sis? Did you really slip out again? You need your rest. How many times do they need to lecture you about this? Just take the hint. Sis? Sis? Is that like a figurative... No, wait. Well, that up... Uh, it clearly means... You're Hasuki. Oh, you finally remembered me. I was hoping you'd get there without any hints, but, well, no use crying over spilled milk. I did kind of half remember you, sort of. I mean, I thought I did, but I couldn't be sure. How many years has it been now? I'm impressed you even recognized me. Mm-hmm, that's what older sisters are for. I couldn't forget my bro bro's bestie. Still, I must have been in elementary school last time. It's been at least 10 years. That's incredible. Okay, time to go home. What? No, no way. This isn't harming me. Just let me talk for a little longer. No. Keep your nose out of my business and go. Now. Man, you're such a killjoy, you know that? Guess I better go before my brother flips out on all of us. See you around. Bye-bye. Well, it looks like the three of you just took a fun little stroll down memory lane. Huh? Oh, no, I was just... Uh... Don't forget, we've all been waiting here for you. The whole time! Sorry, jeez. I apologize at this point. Being late is pretty much a thing now. I don't really mind it, though. I couldn't help her. I'm useless. Pinkoon. So, Hoshino got away, huh? after you managed to rescue her, too. Silver lining is you're all okay. And that's a pretty big victory all its own. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah. And I beat Cannon. Sorry, what? I beat Cannon. Like, in battle. Did you hit your head or something? We're the ones who fought Cannon, and we beat him. I beat him, too. And I helped. Yeah, I can corroborate the punk story. Huh? Time out. He was in my delusion, and I defeated him. I know I did. I know I did, too. Me, too. And me. Same here. Who boy. So now we know there's multiple cannons. It's the only explanation. I've finally been remembered. I guess that's worth being happy over, right? The three of us, together again. Just like old times. I've been wishing for this for a long time now. To hang out with those two and have fun. I've wished and hoped for this every day I've been alone. Maybe that was my delusion. No, it's not a delusion. And I'm going to hang out with them again sometime. But until then, I'll keep waiting for them in this hospital room. Just like I have been. Did you say multiple cannons? I don't even know how to begin processing that. So these delusions... ...are multiplying proportionally to the number of cannons. At least as far as I can tell. Another delusion has already popped up. Where? That karaoke place on Main Street. Singoku Basara. Come on. Let's go take a look for ourselves. What in the world is going on here? Oh, you know what? It's a delusion. Clearly. I think he meant, hey, look, it's not a fairy tale. Looks like a castle to me. Well, it's a little less gauche than the fairy tale delusion, at least. Did Cannon do this, too? <laughs> Hell if I know. At this rate, Akihabara is going to be buried under a mountain of delusions. And how many cannons will that be? I don't get any of this. Anyone see an entrance? Not me. 
If we don't do something soon, then... What are you so worked up about? That it's going to be destroyed. It's not just the Freedom Fighters who set about destroying delusions. There's the DAB, too. The DAB's got bigger fish to fry right now. With cannon on their hands, they won't get to this one for a while. That's right! We should be focusing on chasing down cannon, too! I still haven't gotten my revenge. Are you saying we should just sit back and let this delusion get nullified? <laughs> you do whatever you want. Everyone, please! <laughs> Can't tell if you guys are friends or enemies sometimes. Anyway, I'm heading back. I need to rehydrate pronto. If you're just thirsty, I'll buy you something from the vending machine. Hey, dumbass. Word of the wise. When an adult says he wants to rehydrate, he's after liquor, not a juice box. Oh, so you are a drunk old man. Not an old man, just an adult. And you kids are probably exhausted after all that cannon fighting. Go home, the day is done. <laughs> Fair point. Where the heck do you live anyway? Some hovel around here? Let's just say business hotels have gotten a lot swankier lately. Really make you feel at home. Anyway, see ya. Wait, you gonna come back tomorrow? Now that you've found her, I mean. I haven't really found anything. Huh? Anyway, good night. Call him Harry Houdini, cause he just escaped. I'm going home too. I'm so jealous that they've all got a house to go home to. What, you got a problem with my place? Heck yes I do! Okay, yeah, you've got a point. Well, Pinkun, would you like to come home with me today, then? Yeah! After all you've been through today, you must be completely drained. And I'd like to discuss Saki with you, too, if you don't mind. I'm sure you have lots of stories to share. Mippity, you really are an angel! We can take a bath together again, too, and have a sleepover in my futon. Again? Oh, so now you're paying attention? He stayed with me the whole time you were gone, Asahi. I had no idea. Anyway, we'll see you two tomorrow. Bye-bye! Guess it's just the two of us now. Good. There's something I wanted to talk about, Tachibana. In private. Huh? What is it? I just said in private, didn't I? As in somewhere with less people. The side street should do. Come on. Yeah, this should be good. Not a soul around for, uh, feet. Okay, so what's this all about? It's about him. Him who? Who do you think him? Reiji Shinomiya. Ah, uh, yeah, all right. Did something happen with him? You know the woman he's been searching for? We found her. Hey, long time no see. Reiji? Is it really you? Hey, who is this? Her name is Mari Tojo. Mari Tojo? As in... Yeah. The girl I've been searching for. What are you doing here? Meh, just wrapping up some business. <laughs> business. Meaning you don't want to tell me. See? I don't have to tell you anything. You can read me like a book. Miss Tojo, are you all right? I'm just fine. Who are these men? You didn't see anyone, and Cannon isn't here either. Do I make myself clear? What? B but Do I? Y yes, ma'am. 
I didn't see anything either. You're unusually agreeable today. I've changed. I'm a different man now. Wow. Didn't see that coming. Pretty tense encounter, too. You can tell she's definitely an ex. That's not what I'm talking about. The person Reiji was searching for, Mari Tojo, is involved with the DAB, right? Oh yeah, I guess she would be. And she did say it's been a while. Which means Reiji... Used to work for the DAB. But that agent, or those agents, I guess, looked the other way and let us leave. So what can we learn from that? How am I supposed to know? One way or another, the guy found who he was looking for. What reason does he have to slum around with us now? He sure sounded like he'd be back. And didn't he say something kind of funny when he left? Now that you've found her, I mean... I haven't really found anything. Those were his exact words. I think he must have some kind of nefarious keikaku. A plan. He's using us, I'm sure of it. He does keep telling us that we're looking at his behavior all wrong. So, leader, what's the plan? Are you gonna confront him directly? Probably not. Sounds like a good way to get stonewalled. So you're going to keep pretending not to know. What if he's a double agent? A double agent for the DAB. Okay, now you're just getting paranoid. Why I'm sticking up for someone as rude as him, though, I have no idea. So you're saying you trust him then? Well, I wouldn't go that far. How about this? Before we jump to any conclusions, you and I should try to see through his mask. Find the real Reiji. Our quest starts tomorrow. But real stealthy light, got it? So, a top secret mission on a need to know basis. <laughs> no problem. I was made for this sort of stuff. Sorry to blindside you with this. I'll see you tomorrow then. Get some rest, man. Maybe I should do the same. doing in a place like this I came to thank you I figured you might be passing by sometime tonight oh well uh, in that case sorry I kept you waiting uh, not that I knew you were waiting but sorry nonetheless but seriously it's not like I went out of my way to rescue those two I wanted them safe just as much as you did still thank you this is kind of awkward Oh, but just so you know, I didn't rescue them all by myself or anything. Mippity and Co. were indispensable. You should probably thank them as well. Okay, I will. Just advance warning. When you do, Co. will probably say something like, I didn't plan to rescue anyone. Try not to get too close or she'll pop off your head like a bottle cap. Oh, and careful on your way home, too. Good night. Asahi? Yeah? What's up? I don't want to forget you, Asahi. Nor anyone else. Thank you again, Asahi. Good night. Well, that was... ominous. Sorry I'm late, everyone. Don't lie to us. You're always late. <laughs> Lack of discipline, you ask me. You're here. And? Now that Asahi's here, our little gang's complete. So, what's on the agenda today? Still no castle entrance is what? Any king who would refuse an audience with me should be forced to abdicate. Or maybe it's a queen. Either way. So what do we focus on? Should we look for the castle's Deluser, or keep chasing after Cannon? I say we start our Deluser hunt, just for a change of pace from yesterday. You do that. 
I'm going after Cannon. No, you're going to help us find the Deluser. No, I'm chasing after Cannon. Um, could I ask you two to focus up? We could always split up and do both. Go after Cannon and the Deluser at the same time. Worked well enough yesterday. Crap, didn't plan for that. You two boys look for the Deluser. Me and the girls will seek out Cannon. No objections here. I certainly don't mind either. Hey, Tachibana. Yeah, yeah, I know. I don't want to be stuck with Yamato. Reiji, you take it. You son of a... I don't want that either. I'm fine with just Ryu, thanks. Oh, come on. You're not very popular, are you? Fine then. I don't need any of you. I'll find both of our targets myself. Do it then. Now that that tantrum's over, Reiji and I will look for our Deluser. Ko and Mippity, you two are on cannon duty. As for you, Yamato, you're alone. So, so, so alone. You don't have to phrase it like that. Okay, people, you know the drill. If you find anything, get in contact with me as soon as you can. Let's do this! Reiji, could it? Hey, been a while. Do you know her, Reiji? Yeah, she's... Where have you been, Reiji Poo? I've been so very, very lonely. And it's not like you to be showing up in the middle of the day like this. Not like him how? Why, the two of us would usually meet in the wee hours of the night, relying on that dim, dusky light to get us by. But now we've reunited at long last. And it feels so good. Whoa, Reiji, were you and this lady? No, you idiot, she's a friend of mine. She tends bar at a place I used to frequent. And has a rotten sense of humor. <laughs> nice to meet you. Well, likewise, I'm sure. By the way, Reiji Poo, do you remember our little promise? Promise? No! Don't tell me you've forgotten. Our little promise, just between the two of us. The one we made on that steamy night. So you two actually were... Just shut up, kid. Now, what's all this about a promise? I knew it! You did forget! You think you could just use me as you please, like so much off-brand tissue? Jeez, cool your jets, lady. Could be from a day that got away. Certainly got plenty of those on record. Oh, so you're going to blame it on the drink like that? You can't! Oh, Reiji, this is too good. <sighs> you can believe what you want, but you... What was my promise, exactly? Oh, wouldn't you like to know? Quit making such a big production and spit it out already. Oh, I could just tell you, but where's the fun in that? I know, I've got this patron who simply won't pay up. So, if you go and collect his tab for me... I'll divulge everything. Why the hell should I do your job for you? Lady, you've got yourself a deal. Asahi? Hey, I'm invested in this now. <laughs> you little... Truly? You'll do it? That's wonderful! Yay! <sighs> okay, you win. But you're gonna tell me every last detail about that promise when I'm done. Oh, of course! It'll be just like old times when I'd do anything you made me do. <sighs> Whatever you say. Anyway, where's this tight purse patron we're shaking down? He's a man who loves his booze, so I guess he's not far from some place he can score a drink or ten. Sounds like as good a place to start as any. We'll go check a few likely spots.
well prepared.
MVP parts. Shall we upgrade? Why are we here? I mean, this place does serve alcohol, right? <laughs> Welcome. Hey, Kenny, you got any problem customers who are always skipping out on their tabs? Tabs are forbidden at my establishment, so I'm afraid the answer is no. Cross one off the list. Huh, I had no idea. But I wonder if the person you're looking for isn't Lucky Dan, perchance. Ah, uh, Lucky Dan, of course. What, you know him? Lucky Dan is a pretty gifted programmer. Can't seem to debug his drinking problem, though. We used to tie a few on together, and he'd be toasted in minutes. Then, I'd always end up paying his bill. I suspect you'll find him down at Outska, on the side streets. Got it. Let's go take a look. Hey, Akemi? Yes? Reggie used to go drinking and stuff a lot, right? With other people? Long, long ago. In the before time. Hey, get a move on, Asai. Coming, sorry. Some sweet nectar. Kyushu boys can't live without getting themselves a hit of that shit. Lucky Dan. Hey. Oh! Is that a little ragey Shinomiya? That's right. Been some time, hasn't it? Why, well, it most certainly has. How about it then? A drink to celebrate our long delayed re. re. meeting. I sure wouldn't mind a drink, but I'm babysitting this kid right now. Hey! Not why I'm here, though. Been racking up quite a tab, haven't you, Danny boy? Yeah. Yeah. Now you mention it, I guess I have. Can't remember where or however the hell much, though. <laughs> I was called in to collect. You got enough on you to pay up, you think? Ugh, pain in the ass. Gotta be that one bar. <clears throat> This should be enough. Here. Looks like a reasonable sum to me. Thanks. So, what the hell you been up to all this time, Zina Mia? Eh, this and that. You know it goes. Still working that job of yours? You know, you and that uh, other one, the, the girl. No, I've been out of that game a long time now. No kidding. Well, whatever. You ever have any problems, you come and talk to me, okay? <laughs> I'll fix you right up. Sounds to me like you and I have something in common, Reiji. What the hell are you blabbering about? You're technically a neat. I mean, think about it. Quitting your job and just doing this and that since then? <sighs> Believe what you want. Let's just hurry and hand over this money before I end up spending it. Collected. Blimey! You actually did it! Sure did. So, what was my promise? The one I totally spaced on. You really do want to know, don't you? How cute. <sighs> Hurry up and spill it. <laughs> Not the best.
best choice of words, Ragey Poo. Oh man, this is gonna be juicy. More like Beechwood aged. Uh, what? Booze. It's the one I promised you. A true rarity. <laughs> yeah, I remember now. Not such a bad reward for an honest day's work, really. Don't be a stranger now, okay? Cheers, love. That's not what I was hoping for. What were you hoping for? A promise of love and romance. Of a long-burning passion between adults. Oh, you're such a kid, kid. Well, if you're such an old man, shouldn't you have a story or two to tell of your romantic conquests? Adults don't believe in things like love and romance. They're fairy tales. You'll learn that when you're older. Hey! Hey, wait up!